Let me show you how you can get some beautiful custom fonts inside of CapCut, the video editor. Let me just edge over here so you can get the screen over there. I'm going to hit record on my phone. Three, two, one. Now, the first place you want to go to to get your fonts is dafont.com and search through their fonts and find the beautiful font that you want. If you already have the font, the best thing to do is probably email it to yourself so you can download it in exactly the same way. So we're just going to choose this Granesta font at the very top here. Just hit download here and you're going to download granesta.zip. Hit download. You can see in the bottom here, we've got a little blue arrow. We're going to hit that and then we're going to click downloads. That's going to take us to our downloads. Now you'll see that it downloaded as a .zip. That's okay. We're going to tap on that. And where it says granesta.zip, if you tap that, it will just unzip it and it gives you a folder here. That's all we need to do. We've got the folder that says Granesta. Actually, inside that folder, there are some OTF and TTF, but we don't need to worry about that. Now we're going to go across to CapCut. We're going to start a new project and I'll just choose anything because it doesn't really matter. Let's just choose this one and add this to our new project. Now we're going to add some text here at the bottom and we're going to add text here. Now we're just going to type something, something simple like like this video and then See where we've got font here. You've got text preset, font, and style. Just tap font. And then just below here, you've got all the fonts that they've got. There's loads there, but if you want a custom one, go to add font, just there. Now you're going to hit the plus button, and it'll give you these folders. Don't worry about those. Just go back to browse at the top there, and you're just going to pick downloads. That takes you to the folder that everything gets downloaded to on iOS. Now we're going to hit Granesta. And you can see you've got these. Doesn't really matter. Just pick OTF or whichever is there. Open. And now we've got that font. It's that simple. Now, every time you come back to it, it's going to be in there. You don't have to do that every time. In fact, here is one called Lovely Groovy that um, I downloaded before just when I was checking what to do for this video. It really was that simple. Now, I'm not going to waste your time. Just make sure you've hit the like button on this video. And if you've got any questions, let me know in the comments. If you're one of my subscribers, I will see you in the next video. But if you don't want to subscribe, that's fine. Enjoy life and be kind to others. Take care.